Hi, it's Susan here and welcome to In The Craft Room. Today we've got our hands on issue number 64 and number 65 of the Peter Rabbit Patchwork Quilt Partworks. With issue number 64, you'll receive a piece of the silver mink which will enable us to complete the spade on our central panel applique. We'll also receive a piece of the blue gingham. This fabric is, I believe, for the bias or binding on the outside of the quilt when we're finished. So I'm going to stash this one away. With issue number 65, you will receive the scarlet, teal, light green and the emerald, which will enable us to complete all of the vegetables. Let's get cracking. In the last episode, we began our central panel applique. Today, we're going to complete it. I'm going to add in the handle to the spade the bird and all of the vegetables. Over the last few weeks we've been collecting the template for our central panel applique. This template here is for the silver mink. This template here is for our light green. The template here is for the emerald pieces. We've also got the teal piece templates and the scarlet piece templates. My job now is to trace all of these templates. After tracing our pieces, I'm going to cut them out and pop them on their designated fabrics. out all of our pieces onto the bonder web. There are a whopping 46 pieces and they're all of a regular shape. I'm going to take my time with this and cut out all of our shapes. All of our bonder web shapes have been cut out and placed onto their fabrics. I'm now going to be pressing the bonder web onto the fabrics. I've also got all of our little pieces from last week as well. Time to get mining. They're all pressed on. It's now time for the super fiddly bit. We're going to be cutting out all of the pieces so, so carefully. So all of our 40 plus pieces have been cut out very carefully and that took a very long time. 
I'm going to work systematically across the applique. I'm going to start with the spade handle and the bird and work my way across. I'm also going to remove the backing of the bonder web before I place each section down and I'm going to press it as I go. So I've pressed down the handle of the spade as well as the birdie. I'm going to work across the applique from right to left. So I've just finished pressing all of our applique pieces on and it took um, about two hours for me to work this out and to press it on. I'm going to give it a final press and show you what I've done. And here we have our monumental applique. It took ages but I'm very happy with it. I'll still need to stitch around all of the areas but at least we've got it down on our fabrics. I hope you enjoyed the whole process of the central panel applique Peter Rabbit component. There's a lot more components to go when we're going to be working on the Peter Rabbit lettering as well as the flowers on either side and not to forget the borders. Please don't forget to like and subscribe. Please hit the subscribe button as well as the bell to be notified of future episodes. And I look forward to seeing you next time where we continue on with our central panel applique. Until next time, bye.